Hello dear traders, I'm Anna Kasatkina. You're watching the latest financial calendar on Insta TV. At the beginning of the upcoming week, the following macroeconomic events will see the light of day. On Monday, China will reveal its report on industrial production in April and in the first quarter of 2017. Analysts expect a 6.9% increase in annual terms. In January to March period, China's industrial output advanced by 6.8% in comparison with the previous year. The reading exceeded analysts' forecasts for a slower increase of 6.3%. In March, the country's production rose by 7.6%. On Tuesday, the European Statistical Bureau will publish the GDP data in the first quarter for the Eurozone. Economists suppose that the region's economy expanded by 0.5% on a quarterly basis and by 1.7% in annual terms. In the fourth quarter of 2016, the euro area's gross domestic product grew by 0.5% on a quarterly basis and by 1.8% year over year. According to the flash estimate for the first quarter, the economy of the 19 countries of the eurozone grew by 0.5% in comparison with the previous quarter. The GDP growth in January to March period in 2016 made up 1.7 percent. The dynamics of both indicators coincided with analysts' expectations. On Tuesday, the United States will reveal the report on building permits for April. The forecast calls for a rise in permits by 0.2 percent from the previous month to 1,270,000. In March, the number of new building permits increased by 3.6 percent to 1,260,000 from the previous figure of 1,216,000. The increase was triggered by a jump in the number of permits for building multifamily homes, which rose by 13.8%. At the same time, the number of permits for building single-family homes was down by 1.1%. Nevertheless, the building permits remained near the nine-year high, which was reached in February. On the flip side, the U.S. housing starts decreased in March, which was caused by seasonal factors. Temperatures dropped in March, and southwest and middle Middle East regions suffered from storms. Besides, early next week, the following economic reports will see the light of day. On Monday, New Zealand will publish the retail sales data. On Tuesday, the Reserve Bank of Australia will publish the minutes of its policy meeting. On the same day, the United Kingdom will present the inflation report and Germany will deliver the ZEW Business Sentiment Index. On Wednesday, the United Kingdom will unveil the labor market data and the Eurozone will deliver the Consumer Price Index. And this concludes the latest financial calendar prepared for you by InstaTV team. Thanks for watching and see you back soon. Bye.